Hi there, I'm Kevin. Welcome to my channel. I'd like to talk to you about using canister stoves in the winter. So I've got two canister stoves here. Um, different stoves and different fuel mix. But it's not the stoves that matters. This one starts up nice and easy. This one doesn't. It doesn't start at all right now. Both these stoves have been in my fuel shed overnight at minus 20. And it's about minus 12 right now. What's going on? I can't get this one to start at all. All right, here's the trick. Get yourself some sort of tray. Add your canister stove and add some water. That water is above zero and it's going to warm the fuel. Now, that stove is lighting. All right, simple little trick. The reason this canister wouldn't light in the first place is because it's a simple mix of butane and propane. So regular butane has a boiling temperature of about 0.5 degrees Celsius. Anything lower than that, and that butane gas starts to turn into a liquid. When that happens, your stove will burn all the propane first, and when that's all gone, there'll be no more vapor in the canister, and your stove will stop functioning. This canister is a mix of butane, propane, and isobutane, which, which has a much lower boiling point, so it stays a gas inside that canister. Isobutane has a boiling temperature of about minus 12 degrees Celsius, so that means right down to minus 12, you'll still have isobutane as a vapor inside the canister, and you'll get much better burning performance. Starts no problem, burns nice and loud. I can put this on the ground, and it's gonna stay lit. Not really a problem. It's all about the fuel. It is slowing down a little bit. So if you're using a canister stove in the winter, you wanna make sure that you keep the canister relatively warm so it starts for you. But more importantly, you wanna make sure you're using the right fuel. You don't wanna be using simple butane and propane. You wanna be using a four season blend of propane, isobutane, and butane. So if you want to go much colder than that, you need an inverted canister stove. An inverted stove has a generator which preheats and vaporizes the liquid gas. The canister is turned upside down, and so you're always burning a consistent mixture of gases. Alright, thanks for watching. You have a good day.